So what we're gonna do is we're gonna put ourselves on auto. And we're gonna keep an eye on ourselves. Oh my god, seriously. Oh god, whoa. Alright, here we go. We're gonna go... I am not running away, damn it. Oh, okay, maybe I am running away. What's up, my doomed friends? This is KJ48, and welcome back to my Last Day on Earth Survival Let's Play. Last video, we went into the Alpha Bunker. We got a key code from the developers, and we went into the Alpha Bunker to show it off. We were pretty reckless and kind of stupid, but I had a good time. I think you guys had a good time watching it. The video is doing really well. Actually, you guys have been supporting the hell out of this series. And um, that makes me really, really happy because I like this game quite a bit. And it's always nice when a game I really like is being supported and that means I can play it more. So what are we going to do today? Well, today we are going to head back to Alpha Bunker, but we're going to play it a little bit smarter here. Right now I'm walking here because I'm trying to save up as much energy as possible. My idea is to hit the bunker, loot what's up top, go back down. It, it's, it closes in two and a half hours. Go back down below. I'm not going to try the turret again. I've been watching people record this, this game. I've been talking to people about this game and about the alpha bunker and going, trying to go down inside the alpha bunker at level, <laughs> whatever level I am. Uh, this is it right here, right? No, whatever level I am. Uh, I think I'm 13. Yeah, I'm 13 because I, I'm not quite 14. I know I'm not 12. So that means I'm 13. Unlucky 13. Not cool, guys. Not cool. Anyway, um, from what I've been <laughs> from what I've been hearing, going down at level 13 with a pistol and cloth cloth gear is pretty stupid and foolhardy. And I paid the price. But again, I don't really care because it was a pretty fun video. And I think you guys had a good time watching it. So we're going to speed this up. And that's what we're going to do. We're going to check out the Alpha Bunker. If you end up enjoying this video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. So, you guys, I mentioned at the end of the last video that I didn't have any weapons to go down into the bunker again. And I was kind of upset about that. And you guys helpfully reminded me that I didn't loot these, uh, these uh, lockers here. So, I know there's going to be a full set of gear and a pistol in one of these lockers. So, that's what we're going to do now. We're going to loot these lockers. And that is pretty awesome. Kind of wish I looted these lockers earlier in the week because they actually reset this whole bunker thing. So I think these, <laughs> I think if I looted these already, they would have restocked, which would have been really pr freaking cool. But, you know, what are you going to do? It just would have been more gear I lost downstairs. <laughs> There's the one I'm looking for. All right, that's why I did not bring any gear with me because we're going to put all this on. It's going to break pretty quick, but I don't plan on getting hit too much down there. And uh, that looks pretty good. All right. So let's go ahead and loot the rest of these. We're going to loot everything up here. Then we're going to go downstairs. We're going to check those extra those extra rooms, uh, you know, that I kind of passed up while heading towards the turret. And then uh, once we're done with those extra rooms, we're going to go to a yellow zone. And I uh, do a little bit of farming in a yellow zone. I'm going to try and... I'm going to try and up where I'm farming because I have been farming... Uh, by the way, I'm going to keep some stuff in here. I ha I'm actually going to keep everything in here. I'm not going to need for the fight. I have been farming... Um, Quite a bit, uh, but I've been farming in the green zones, and I think it might be time to kind of move up a little bit in uh, in another zone, you know, a harder zone. I think that could be pretty pretty freaking cool, so I think that's what we're going to do. I think we're going to go farm the yellow zone and see what's what. I think, um, I think I'm getting to the point where I can make some gear so I could survive in the yellow zone uh, and survive, you know, relatively easily. I mean, I could survive in the yellow zone, but it might not be the best way to go. But now that I can make the makeshift bat and a bunch of, you know, cloth gear... That's going to be pretty nice. It's going to be pretty nice. The only thing I don't like about the makeshift bat is it takes duct tape. And I'm kind of worried about what else in the game takes duct tape, right? So, yeah, because I don't want to use it all and then find out I needed it for something else. So now what we're going to do is we're going to store everything over here that we do not need to carry with us. I'll even store this extra food. Um, I'm hoping we're not going to need to heal too much. I, I'm pretty decked out in armor. It's not the best armor, but it's it's up there. And um, I'm hoping I won't have to, you know, take too many hits because I should be able to um, use my range pistol and not have too much of an issue. Yeah, coming down here at my level with my gear was just... Oh, I didn't even notice there was a door over here. Is there a door here? It's green. You see that little green right there? Doesn't that mean there's a door there? Oh, terminal. It's a terminal. Okay. All right. I guess uh, the terminal opens the door. Anyway, uh, yeah, coming down here with the gear I had was pretty stupid. I did some research. I asked some people stuff. I watched people play. And, uh, you know, people are coming down here with tactical gear and, like, AKs and stuff. So, uh, me coming down here with what I had, I was just asking for trouble. 
Um, if I had it to do all over again, would I do it again? Oh my god, look at the guns. Alright, hold on. If I had it to do all over again, would I do it again? Hells yeah, that was a fun video, guys. I don't mind dying, whatever, man. It's like, I get that stuff back, no big deal. But anyway, look at over here, man. Look at the AKs. One, two, three. Three AKs, and there's three M16s or M2s or M82s or whatever they're called. Rifles. Over here, but I can't get through here. God darn it. Let me get in there. And what's up with this? I can't loot this. I don't know. All right, well, let's check out some of these rooms, guys. Oh, boy. What do we got in there? We got some fast biters. That is just fine by me. I would like to use some melee weapons, honestly. Um, but I don't have any, so what are you going to do? That's what happens when you die and lose everything. All right, can we just grab one of these? Can we shoot him? Yeah, we can. All right, down you go! Yeah, smoked! You ain't getting a hit off on me, punks. My gear is not the best. I don't want it to break. I mean, have a have a heart. All right, so this looks like the shower area of the bunker and the, the toilets. Uh, what is that? This is a pole, some pipe going up into the thing. Can I loot the toilet bowl? No. Man, in seven days to die, I'd get some pistols out of the toilet bowls. Where's the where's the toilet bowl loot, guys? <laughs> All right, so let's see what's in here. All right, so we got a toxic abomination. So that should be pretty fun. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. I'm hitting the wrong button to attack. All right, here we go. Run away. Run away. Don't get hit. No, don't get hit by him either. Oh my goodness. So it looks like the toxic, uh, toxic abomination is a lot faster than the other guy. I don't know what the other one is. Is he a floater bloater or whatever? All right, I've got some healing items. Let's just tank these guys. I'm sick of running away. I got armor on. What the hell? All right. So yeah, we got a floater bloater and a toxic avenger or whatever the hell he was. <laughs> toxic uh, scumbag. Dead toxic guy. All right. So there's nothing in here to loot either, huh? Okay, all right. So my gun is not looking good. Actually, it's almost dead. That's not... That ain't cool. That ain't cool. Uh, once my gun's dead, we're going to farm. And uh, even when I farm... Jesus, I'm going to try and farm a yellow zone with probably that, like, crappy stick. Maybe I'll go home before I farm. Yeah, maybe I'll do that. All right, well, it doesn't look like there's anything in here. It looks like this is uh, a gas thing. Yeah, it holds gas or whatever. I don't know. Maybe, um, maybe it holds the uh, gasoline to power the place. So, all right, so let's come on down here. Yeah, fast biter. Yeah, we're probably going to get chased out of here. Whoop. Yep, here we go. Time to go rocky. -da -da, da -da -da. Yeah, suck it, stupid zombies. All right, so this is where people sleep. There's nothing in these lockers, man. There's nothing over here. I got some beds. Take a nap. Maybe I should take a nap. It looks like my stuff is breaking. I now have no longer have pants. What has happened to my pants? I don't know. Oh, we can't take that guy punching. Oh, boy. All right. Um, not really sure what I want to do here. I'm going to try and sneak over here. It looks like we actually have something we can loot. But I think I'm pretty much done in this area. Let's see if we can loot this. All right. Don't look. Don't look, guys. It doesn't look like there's anything else to loot in here. Okay. So we got nothing. All right. Let's get out of here. Yeah, there's nothing else to loot in there. I think we're done with the bunker. Guys, Alpha Bunker's pretty awesome. I'm going to come back when I'm much higher level. I think at level 40, I get to make my first pistol. I think we're going to come back at that point. Um, been, it's been fun, though. It's a pretty cool place. Uh, it's just, um, it's tough, you know? It's it's not made for the level I'm at, you know? Which is which makes sense, you know? I mean, you're not going to go... you, you got to have end game, and if, and if this wasn't end game, then what would be right now? So, all right, let's get out of here. Let's travel home. Uh, I did not expect to have to travel home. That kind of blows. But, oh, no, 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 no. Let's go back and grab stuff before we travel home. I have, there's a lot of stuff here I could, I could bring home. All right, so I'm going to travel home. I'll see you guys back at base. All right, guys, here we are, and here's my gear. Uh, the helmet and the bre and the chest piece are gonna, about to break, so I'm going to bring some backup stuff. Same with the boots. Um, I actually did have some more melee stuff upstairs at the bunker, but there was no there was no other loot in there. I'm, I pretty much know that for a fact. Um, so I decided not to explore any more of the bunker. Um, so here we go. We got ourselves a paddle, 
Um, we got ourselves a crowbar and we got ourselves a hammer. We're going to a yellow zone. It should be pretty tough. I'm trying to walk out of there with a good amount of experience. Um, honestly, what I'm really looking for mostly is experience. I probably will not gather any wood or stone. Oh, hold on. Change of plans. Change of plans. Okay, so it'll take... 28 to get to the yellow zone and 11 to get here. Yeah, we should have plenty of I just want to make sure I can get to that zone, you know So I want to make sure I can get to the yellow zone because the um the airdrop is simply one airdrop There's nothing else in the area. So it's not that you know, not that big of a deal So we're also gonna try and sneak around a little bit as much as we can and uh, try not to take too much damage here All right, we should see what we could see there. So there's gonna be a guy over there. What do we got? Right? Oh god There's a lot of them. we got a roaming zombie we got a uh, fast zombie which spotted us, so it is what it is. Let's not fight him and the roaming zombie at the same time. There's no there's no point in that. We'll fight one at a time, so the hammer has taken care of business there. And the roaming zombie is now doing barely any damage because of the gear I'm wearing. Um, the armor is really important. Even cloth armor is kind of a, a really good thing to have. All right, so what do we got here? Uh, what are you? You are a fast biter. We're going to try and smack you in the back of the head. There we go. We got this surprise attack damage. That's nice. I don't know what these two are. They could be fast biters. They could be regular guys. Oh, that's a regular guy. That's yeah, fine. We'll take care of you. Uh, I should probably kill the deer as well. Um, I should probably sneak attack the deer, but we're going to hold off on that for now. Ah, crap. We waited too long. That's okay. All right. So we're going to smack you a little bit. Let's go ahead and grab some food. Uh, we're not gonna eat anymore because uh, hopefully we don't have to eat again because we're gonna level up pretty soon And then we will uh, go ahead and get ourselves a um, <laughs> We'll go ahead and get ourselves a level and then we'll uh, get full on hit points All right, so here we go. So what are you? All right, you're just a regular guy I'm Gonna take you out might see a player pretty soon uh, All right, let's just uh, go ahead and open this now before we see a player uh, So people are telling me they don't fight players in green zones because they're crap. Their crap is so garbage um so maybe I'll start doing that. Uh, oh, that's pretty nice. That's pretty nice. That's a. That's not bad. I like the machete. That was a good drop right there. Now should we should we stay here fighting stuff or should we go to the next zone? I think we should uh, fight this guy. All right. Damn it. Oh, we got a player on us now. That's okay. All right, he's dead, and then we're gonna take care of the player. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna put ourselves on auto. And we're gonna keep an eye on ourselves. Oh my god, seriously. Oh god, whoa. Alright, here we go. We're gonna go. I'm not running away, damn it. Oh, okay, maybe I am running away. I'm not gonna fight three people. That sucks. I got a hockey stick too, and I, I lost them now because. Oh, I, I, hmm. I'm so afraid of death now that, like, you know, I just ran when I shouldn't have, basically. That was pretty stupid. My hammer broke. I don't think I could have healed myself. I got my hammer up there quickly enough. Uh, but that is okay. That is okay. All right, let's use that. Oh, actually, oh, hold on. All right. Uh, you go on auto, and I will take care of business while you're on auto. I wish you could see your hit points when you're in, when you're in your inventory, right? That would, be, uh, that would be quite helpful. All right, we are not going to use that wood. Let's just destroy it. And what are we doing here? Um, we're going to keep the food in here for health. We're going to put on the hat. Uh, what else did I want to do? I think we're pretty good now. Um, all right. So let's see how. Let's see what he's got first of all. Rope. Three rope. Okay. And let's see what this guy's got. Fast biter. So this uh, paddle is pretty slow, but, you know, what are you going to do? It's got, um, it does a good amount of damage. So. All right. I'm going to run around here and see if I can get that player back. I, this is stupid. I can't believe I had to run from that player. That is so irritating. And now I stink, too. Um, all right, let's just go to the next zone. And now I stink, so it's going to be a lot harder to sneak up on zombies in the next zone. So that kind of blows. We need a portable shower. That's what we need. All right, let's run through the yellow zone. 22 energy. Actually, I could probably run back home after this even. That's not bad. 31? What was it? No, I think it's, I think it's close to 31, but not quite there. All right, so there we go. And enter. And uh, we're going to have to be a little careful here. Although, again, we're stinking, so... What are you going to do? I mean, oh boy, here we go. These guys are actually uh, a little tough to dodge their puke, uh, their spit. I find myself not being able to dodge their spit very well, so kind of blows, but it is what it is. All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to move this in here. We're going to put this up here. All right, and let's see what we can do. All right, so what do we got up here? Oh, he saw me. 
All right, well, whatever. We're going to fight, people. We're going to fight. So these bandages will give me 40 hit points back. So just got to be aware of that. All right, so when we get down below 60... Come on, with the freaking more than one guy on me. What the hell? All right, well, whatever. We're just going to heal through this. There we go. Leveled up. Okay. Yeah, when they gang up on you, it's a little tough. We just got a lot of cloth there, though. That's really nice. Getting all that cloth. Now, there's no way we're going to be able to sneak up on anything anymore. I don't even think I'm going to try. It's just slowing me down. It's pointless. All right, what are you... Fast Biter. Come at me, Fast Biter. So let's see how many hit points we get for Fast Biters. I'm curious. 100. Don't we get like 50 hit points for a regular zombie? I, I'm not paying I haven't been paying attention, but I think I'm going to. Let's see what we get for killing a... Oh, never mind. Alright, so we got a wolf on us. We should be okay with that. You're dead, and the wolf is next. There we go. And we'll loot you up. And then in the meantime, we'll uh, grab this and eat this to get our hit points back. There we go. All right, wolf. Okay, so what does the wolf give us? Let's take a look. Okay, 50 hit points for the wolf. I think regular zombies are 50 hit points. So the, the you know, fight, fighting a fast biter is really the way to go. That's a cool looking fast biter, by the way. Okay, yeah, so there we go. And let's see what we get for a player. Crap, I don't have any more hip I don't have anything more to heal with. Son of a bitch. He had some good gear, man. I couldn't do any damage to him. Man, that was rough. Yeah, I don't think I have any I don't think I have anything else to heal with. I could probably grab some food out of my um storage, so let's do that. Alright guys, I'm going to be doing a little bit of post-commentary here. I was just sent an email by the devs. Um, apparently, they want me to explain to you guys how to get into the Alpha Bunker. Now, I recorded this episode and the next episode before I actually saw the email. Um, so, I'm going to put this in, in somewhere in a post-commentary form. Okay? Uh, basically, they said many uh, people do not know how to get into the bunker, so they'd be happy if I would describe it. Um, I'd be more than happy to. Alright, uh, to get the code, you have to check the radio in your house for an exclamation mark above it. If there's a mark, it means the code is available to you. Now, the radio has got to be the CB radio. Um, I'm not super familiar with this game, but um, I would assume that's a CB radio. You guys let me know in the comments if you think that's the case. And um, try it and let me know in your games. Has it been working for you? I don't have the CB radio yet, so I can't check. Um, click on the radio, learn the code, reach the bunker, and enter the code, and you are done. Note, the code is changed once a day and is available at 12 a.m. GMT. Or 3 a.m. Moscow time, which is GMT plus 3. Um, I guess these um, these developers are from uh, Russia, so I guess that's why they gave me the Moscow time. So there you go, guys. Um, one more time, check the radio in your house. Uh, you guys check your radios. I don't have a CB radio. You let me know in the comments, did that work for you? I'm really, really interested in this, and I'm going to go work on my CB radio. All right, back to the regular commentary. I like the fight a player I didn't have to run away from. <laughs> the problem is the zombies, like, soften me up, and then the players kind of come in, like, later on, you know? And, hmm. I should probably grab berries, but, you know, for healing. I really should. Oh, well. Maybe we'll grab some berries after this. Because if I get attacked by a player, I don't want to have to run again. All right, yeah, let's grab some berries, people. We're going to grab some berries. We also got some points here. Uh, we'll deal with the points a little bit later. Here we go with a player. All right, so he's got a stick, so I should be okay. <laughs> Thank God. He's got some decent clothes, but, this, you know. All right, so we got to take a look at that. Um, let's get some hit point. Let's get some uh, hit point regeneration items here just in case we get jumped while we're doing this. Uh, let's go ahead and get our hit points up a little bit. And let's see what we got here. All right, so I want to eat this. I want to take this and this and this and this. I kind of want to take that ATV wheel. Uh, what would I what would I leave here for the ATV wheel? Is it, I don't think any of my clothes are broken, so I can't drop anything off. Uh, these shoes are pretty easy to make, and those are almost broken, so I'll take the AV wheel over that. Okay. Feel a little bit better now, guys. I fought a guy who was, I didn't have to run away from, even though all he had was a stick. Um, oh boy. <laughs> All right, fast biter, you die. You die now. Hell's yeah. All right, so my pants are wrecked. So what we're gonna do is we are going to put these on. There we go. That's inventory management at its finest. 
Um, our crowbar is almost done. I do have another item, so I'm not going to really worry about that. Um, let's kill everything first. Yeah, I think I could do yellow zones. I think I could do yellow zones. See me pull that one guy away without pulling anything else? That's pretty good, right? right I'm going to grab some berries here. There we go. Let's take a look in this thing. I will probably leave some stuff in here. Can I come back? If I leave stuff in here and come back for it, can I Can I do that? Uh, there, and there. Honestly, I don't know. Yeah, like if I, if I want to leave stuff in this bag, could I theoretically travel home and then come back? How long before it resets? Ooh, a lock and key. Uh, wow. I don't know how that would be useful, but I kind of want it just because I've never seen it before. Yeah, I kind of want that. I don't see how it could be useful, but who knows. Okay. Doing good, guys. We're doing good. I think we've cleaned this place pretty much out. I mean, we had to run away for some players, but to be perfectly honest, we, we didn't have all the healing items we wanted. I, I'm making excuses. I shouldn't have to run away from those players. <laughs> yeah, that was a failure. That was a failure, but that's okay. Overall, I think we did okay in the zone. All right, all right. Let's head home. Let's uh, let's take a look at let's like take a look at the build. We didn't get any woods. So we can't build anything. But I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna put our points where we want them to be. Can we get home? That is the question. And we can. Okay. Cool. I don't have to make a video. I'm putting this up every other day. You guys have been supporting the hell out of this out of this let's play. Um, keep liking and thumb. Uh, keep giving the likes and stuff, guys, and keep uh. You know, keep watching because I really, really love this game and I really want to be able to play it more. Um, sometimes I'll play a game when it doesn't do well on my channel, but sometimes I just have no choice. Um, and I'm really enjoying this game, so that is awesome. That is awesome. All right, first things first, we're going to go ahead and take a shower. Um, I don't think we have any water with us. Yeah, we don't. All right, let's go check the food chest. That's where I'd keep the water. All right, so we do have some water bottles here. We got to get the the, rain, the water catch thing going. Um, so let's put this stuff in here. Anything else? No. That is fine. That is fine. Let's come on in here. Let's come in our thing and take that and that and that. And then let's come over here and take our shower. Use two of those bottles on the shower. And, uh, I, yeah, we got to set up the water catch. Actually, did we set up the water catch? I don't think we did. I think we should probably do that now. I probably need some wood for it, though, and I don't think I have a lot of wood at in this base right now. So... That could be a problem. All right, let's take a look here. Let's put some stuff in here. There we go. Keep that. We're going to keep that. Uh, I could put these in here. That's fine. All right, let's see what we need for the water catch. I can't believe I didn't make it. I thought I made it. Hmm, I guess not. All right, well, let's spend our points first. All right? So uh, we definitely want the chest. That's a, that's a given. Okay? The other thing we want is... We can't do the meat dryer if we do the tanning rack. I don't care about the torch or the stone cutter's table just yet. Um, probably going to need a melting furnace pretty soon. Um, yeah, okay. Uh, yeah, I think we'll do the tanning rack. That should be good. Because I'd really like to make that um, and see exactly what it does. I mean, I'm guessing it's just going to give me like leather or something. I don't really know. Uh, let's take a look at what we can make here. Okay. Rain catch. All right. Yeah, we need 10 logs. I'm pretty sure we do not have a lot of logs. Let's check out our food area first. All right. So that's good. Can't, can't double click that out, huh? All right. And how about you? You're looking good. Put that in there. Put this in here. Okay. Okay. So there's no wood in there. I would normally keep some wood in the uh, box, you know, next to, next to all my cooking supplies. We got two wood here. Yeah, we don't, we don't have enough wood for anything. I'm going to have to do some farming. I'm going to have to do some grinding. Like actual just uh, chopping trees grinding. I'll probably do that in the green zone. There's not much point to be going to the, going to a yellow zone. Um, I mean, I guess I would get more experience, but... I don't know. I kind of I kind of want uh, wood at this point. Yeah, I'm not seeing any. Okay, okay. I guess I can't make that. Is there anything we can make? Oh, oh, God, we need planks for this. Okay, never mind, never mind. Okay, guys, well, 
I think this is a good time to call it. Uh, thank you very much for watching. I will see you next time. And until then, take it easy.